it's Ty Bug, and we're back in the kitchen. Wow, all my videos have been in the kitchen recently. <laughs> I did not expect to be filming in here so soon after my onigiri video and my stretching video, but I had to. You know why? Because I am being haunted. I, I can't explain it. They're following me everywhere, and it is the souffle pancakes from Japan. It started like a couple months ago. I clicked on a picture of a souffle pancake because obviously they look delicious. And then I only clicked on it once. And then my entire Instagram, uh, what is it called? It's not the For You page, the Discover page is filled with souffle pancakes. Like it won't even be like the first picture. I'll click on one picture and then I'll be scrolling down then souffle pancake, souffle pancake, souffle pancake. And then it started on my YouTube too. All my recommended videos are like how to make souffle pancakes or souffle pancakes or I went to Japan and had souffle pancakes. So you know what? I'm done. I am conceding. You win. We're making souffle pancakes. And I have my recipe. Oh, you can't see it. I don't know how to fix that. <laughs> oh, I just bent it. I have my uh, recipe written down here. It is by Namiko Chen. I will link her recipe down below, but um, it looks very difficult. I don't have like some of the tools like I'm supposed to sift the flour, but I don't have a sifter, so I'm just gonna use this because it has the small holes. So let's get started. And I have a camera up here so I can look down at the bowl and you guys, let go. So I got my jumbo eggs. And it says to separate, hello Mika, the egg whites from the egg yolks. I found a trick online that the easiest way, it's from Bon Appetit, you know, the best cooking um, YouTube channel. No offense to all the other cooking YouTube channels. It's offensive to me. No, it's not. <laughs> it's been a hard time. You know why. I'm not going to talk about it. Okay. So the easiest way to separate an egg yolk from an egg white is usually just your hands. Because if you use a spoon, it can get separated, and then it's all weird. So we're going to do two jumbo eggs, and we're going to separate the egg white from the egg yolk. Look at that crap. Hi, Mika. The perfect pour. Oh, wow, you can't see it. And I'm going to put the egg yolk into my bigger bowl here. Gross. Release. Ew, this one got sep- gosh darn it. <laughs> what do I do? Did I ruin it? It has yolk in it. I'm gonna get a spoon to clean that out. Wait. See, the difficulties are already starting. Oh my god. So much for my trick. You know what? Screw it. It's egg whites. <laughs> and we need to freeze the egg whites. I don't have room in my freezer. We'll improvise. Milk and vanilla to egg yolks until thick and frothy. So I don't usually drink whole milk, but the recipe calls for whole milk, so I'm assuming that's important. So we're gonna do whole milk. Hopefully, I'm not lactose intolerant or anything, but don't want to get sick. Because I haven't drank whole milk in a long time. Who designed this? Because now I'm not gonna know what this is. It is what it is. There are bigger things in the world. It's just milk. Okay. One and one half tablespoon whole milk. Okay, got one tablespoon. Wait, that's four tablespoons. One tablespoon. Wait. Oh, one and one half. Here we go. Sorry. <laughs> My brain was like, what the heck? So here's these. Gonna do the milk. Hi, Mika. 
Why can't I do this? Am I weak? There we go. So a little bit extra. This is probably a way too big bowl for all of this. And now I have all this extra milk. I guess I could just make a whole bunch of souffle pancakes if this turns out. Okay, and then vanilla extract. And it's one fourth teaspoon. We're just gonna mix that until thick and frothy. Yeah, this bowl is way too big. I wonder how many pancakes this is supposed to make. Never set a timer for 15 minutes. Okay, it's 3.15 now. It's not in the morning. I'm making pancakes for lunch. And I'm going to say it's done at 3.25. Because I don't remember what time I put it in. Okay, well, it's not getting thick, but it is getting frothy. What constitutes as thick in this? Okay, I don't think it's getting any thicker than that. And oh, let me put my eggs away. Can eggs go bad if you have them out? And then we have our cake flour. I had to look up that cake flour is different than regular flour, so then I had to go get cake flour. But don't worry, I got this before everything started going on. Bless you. So, um, stay inside. And bless you, Mika. One fourth. I just said one fourth cake flour. Is it one fourth cup? One fourth tablespoon? Come on, Ty, what is it? <laughs> I love myself, let me go look it up. So it's one fourth cup. That's a good distinction. So I don't know how much is this supposed to make. I think this is a small serving. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, now to sift it. Oh wow, this is working beautifully. I am a genius. <gasps> I guess that makes up for what I accidentally spilt in. I forgot to put in the baking powder. So um, I don't have baking powder either. I have baking soda. So I'm going to, I looked up the equivalent of baking powder, baking soda. So one tablespoon of baking soda is three tablespoons of powder. So one fourth is 0.75 of baking powder. One fourth teaspoon is one third teaspoon. It's close enough, okay? We're gonna do a teaspoon, a one fourth teaspoon. I think I need to start over because I did a one and a half teaspoon of whole milk instead of one and a half tablespoon. And then my egg whites are all messed up. And this is all messed up. What would be the responsible thing to do? I don't want to waste any food, but this is not going to turn out. I don't know if it's too late to add in the milk now. You know what? I'm going to try it because I don't want to waste it. And I'm gonna put in another, how many teaspoons are in a tablespoon? I'll look that up, I'll figure that out. I'll try and fix this. I'll see what happens with the egg whites. And then I'll <laughs> film me doing another batch. So this is gonna be a long video, okay? If you want like a quick and precise video, I'll link one down below that's really good. I love it because it's like silent and aesthetic and gorgeous. Yeah, this is just like, watch me try. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try to fix this and then it's time for my egg whites. Hi, so Mika, you're right in where I need to stand. Thank you. <laughs> I had to restart. I whisked the egg whites for about like 20 minutes and they never made peaks. I tried to use a hand mist. M m a hand whisker, but it didn't whisker. I don't know how to say it, okay? You know what I'm trying to say. And it didn't work, so here we go again. And I'm gonna double the recipe. So four eggs. 
this is just a recipe for disaster now if I'm I'm going crazy. It's okay. Okay. We got this. I'm gonna make a mess. I wonder if I can scoop up the yolk. <gasps> Lord hallelujah. Help release the egg whites. And then yolk. Oh my god, that was so much easier. I guess the trick with the hand only works if you're a pro chef. Ooh, this one's a broken yolk. Gotta hurry. No, don't do this to me. Please. These crack. Uh, if, is this a double yolk? Oh my god, it's a double yolk. You just ruined my recipe! <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> the yolk broke! <laughs> I'm so mad. At this point I just feel like I'm wasting eggs. Should I just make scrambled eggs? anymore. You can't see it. This isn't a cooking video anymore. This is just an entertainment video, okay? Stupid egg. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my. At least I look cute. What happened is I couldn't separate the egg yolk from the egg white, so my new egg whites have some egg yolk in it. But then I got some egg yolk because the yolk broke and I had a double yolk. <laughs> I hate saying yolk. <laughs> um, into the egg carton, so I couldn't put the egg carton back into the fridge because then it'd be like a bleh, gross. So um, we tripled the recipe now. <laughs> so at this point, there's no return because I used all the eggs. And I really don't want to waste it. And I will not cry. Thank you, Mika, for your support. Okay, here are my, what are, egg yolks. So in the egg yolks, add milk and vanilla to egg yolks. So the milk, we're tripling it now. I'm sorry, I'm talking to myself. One and a half tablespoon. Here's one tablespoon. Do I have a half tablespoon? Here's one tablespoon. <laughs> one, one half. One, one half. One, one half. Was that three? We're gonna say it's three. You know what? Nope. No return. No return. This is the final countdown. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Don't get copyrighted for that, please. <laughs> Into the sink. Shot. Okay. One fourth teaspoon pure vanilla extract. One fourth teaspoon. Oh my god. One, two, three, three one-fourths. I hope this entertains you guys because it hurts. First they taunt me on Instagram, then they taunt me on YouTube, then they taunt me on Twitter, and now they're taunting me in person. Thank you, Souffle Pancakes. And it's not like I can just go down to uh, Shirky and get some fluffy pancakes. Or, uh, fluffy pancakes, what are these called? Souffle pancakes. And it's not like I can go to Japan, cause you know. <laughs> My crazy is coming out. I don't know what it means by thick and frothy, cause this isn't getting thick and frothy. I look like an angry housewife. 
<laughs> An Angry Cottage Housewife. I don't know why this reminded me of it, but Angry Cottage Housewife. Are you guys playing Animal Crossing? I am. My best friend just got it, so I'm excited to play with her. So I'm also getting the online... I just put my hand in an egg white. Online pass. So if you guys want to play together, leave a comment down below or message me on Twitter or Instagram. And maybe we... Wow, that was a quick change in emotion. Okay, I think that's as frothy as it's gonna get. It didn't get thick at all, though. I'm the only thick here! <gasps> okay, now we're gonna sift the cake flour. Cake flour. <laughs> I need to take a shower after this. I'm making a giant mess. And you know what? That's the least of my problems right now. And don't mind if my voice just starts cutting out. This is the most I've talked in like weeks. <laughs> okay, I don't remember what equation I figured out for the baking soda. So we just gonna wing it. I think it was one fourth teaspoon. I mean, already this is looking a lot better than my first batch. It's time. Let's see if this works better. I'm gonna do this, cause this was easier. And my hands hurt. And it has a beat option. So I'm gonna do it until the egg whites are frothy and pale white, and then I'll add the sugar. <laughs> Two tablespoons sugar, and then we're gonna triple it, so that's six tablespoons sugar. One fifth at a time, six divided by one fifth. What is six divided by one fifth? Or is it six times one fifth? Guys, I got an A in my math class, okay? I'm. Alright, one divided by five is point two. Six times point two equals one point two. So one. Point two tablespoons at a time. <laughs> I'll just do one tablespoon at a time. One out of six. Two out of six. Three out of six. Did I say four out of six? And then I'll make peaks. Here's hoping. You know what? I don't care anymore. Let's fold it in. I don't know what folding it in means either. See, this just isn't the right recipe for me, I think. Okay, let's go over to the, the stove. <laughs> so I did a light coating of avocado oil spray. This is from Costco. And then, should I go on my tippy toes this whole time? Okay, and, whoa, I lost my train of thought real fast. And then you're gonna do low heat and each pancake is going to get four scoops, but you're going to start off with two. Um, let's see if this works. I feel like they're just going to fall apart. And I feel like I need a bigger spoon. I'm using so many utensils. I don't think it's supposed to do that. So it's supposed to stay in a little pile. 
This is like making a crepe. I don't think I should even try to. Yeah, no, it just falls apart. Okay, that's it, guys. It failed. I don't know if I'll even post this. If you guys have... Well, if you guys have had a failed cooking experience like this too, let me know down in the comments below. Make sure to like and subscribe. I promise all videos aren't like this. I feel really bad about this video, actually. Yeah, it didn't make anything. It couldn't even make a crepe. Okay, hope you guys are safe and healthy. Bye.